This is done Henry 1970 and if you look close you can see that it doesn't fucking work. That's right. I am not a perfect man, I have made mistakes in my life and the day I decided to purchase this piece of shit I made several. First was assuming that members of Dan Henry customer support team are not as crooked as the alignment of the date wheel on their watches. Second that I assumed that their warranty that comes with the monstrosities they call watches is legit. Spoiler alert. It was not. This story had an innocent start. I was on their website when I saw this watch. Like a complete dumbass I thought that the design of this watch was original and not a ripoff of Exactus Aquamax from 1969. I noticed that they only shipped with DHL. We all know how much DHL likes to slap us with nasty brokerage and fee charges at the door. So as any dashing gentleman would, I tried to avoid that shit so I contacted their customer support team. I asked if they could ship it using a different company. I would not have placed the order if they could not. They said they would do that for me if I placed the order. And then I placed the order. Those slimy fucks shipped it with DHL anyway. I ended up paying a shit ton of money in unnecessary charges to DHL when I could have spent it on blow instead. What the fuck? Things got worse immediately. When I opened the package I was greeted by a broken watch you see on the screen right now. Something was obviously wrong with the movement as the watch did not start. But since I had their international warranty card on hand I had nothing to worry about, right? Wrong. At the request of their crooked customer support I shipped it back to them for a warranty replacement or a refund using their preferred and costly shipping method which they assured me I would receive reimbursement for. Do you think I got fucked over again? Of course I got fucked over again. I heard nothing from their customer support team for a month after this piece of shit arrived back to China. I wrote to them again and inquired about the status of my refund. They accused me of opening the watch and damaging the movement and said that I'd have to pay to have it repaired. What the actual fuck? Why would I open the watch when I had their warranty and I'm not a watchmaker? Realizing I was dealing with a bunch of scamming butt wipes I filed a PayPal dispute. I provided all the screenshots of interaction and emails as evidence. I won the dispute. They were forced to pay me the original cost of the watch. However the DHL and return shipping costs were never reimbursed. I lost plenty of money I could have spent on Blow and YouTube premiums instead. Can I say anything positive about this watch? It has a decent steel case. But that doesn't make up for the fact the loom on the indices is not evenly applied and the surface of the hands looks like it was polished with a jackhammer. Listen buddy boys, if you have $290 burning a hole in your pocket just spend it on a hooker. You will end up with an STD but at least you will have fun getting it. With Dan Henry 1970 you're just getting an STD with a crooked date window. Thank you for coming to my TED talk.